Good morning, Eagles. Happy Hybrid Monday. It is time for us to start another amazing Olin day. Every day we take a moment to honor our country with the Pledge of Allegiance. At this time, I'd like you to please stand and face the flag. Place your right hand over your heart. Ready? Begin. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you. Please be seated. Eagles, today I'd like to talk to you about your choices by sharing some words of wisdom by American statesman William Jennings Bryan. He says, Destiny is not a matter of chance. It is a matter of choice. So let's talk about that word destiny. Our destiny is our destination in life, where we are headed. When you go on vacation, well, we're not really going on vacations this year, but when you used to go on a vacation, your destination might be a campground, the beach, maybe Hawaii, or your grandma's house. That's your destination. But that destination is chosen by your family, right? Mr. Bryan isn't talking about vacations. That's not the destination he's talking about. He's talking about where we're all headed in life, not just at school, but in the big wide world. Will you end up in the honor roll? Will you end up at an amazing college? Will you be a great musician? Will you be known as the world's greatest therapist? Who knows? Today, ask yourself what choices you need to make to get to where you want to be for your destination. Sometimes the choices we make today have a profound effect on our destination and our destiny tomorrow. Today's featured lunch item has not been posted on the website yet, so we will all find out together when we pick up our meals from Mrs. Cook. One thing we do know is that we should thank the food services staff for providing the children in Brea with delicious and nutritious meals. Today's animal facts are about the golden doodle. That's a golden doodle puppy. Oh, it's all cute. It looks like a stuffed animal. That's a golden doodle after it's grown up. Still looks so cute. Golden doodles are a relatively new dog breed. They first appeared in America during the 1990s. Y'all weren't born, but that's when they first came around. Their adorable name was coined in 1992. These dogs are not officially registered as a breed of their own. They're considered a designer breed, which means both of the parents are purebreds. One of them is a golden retriever, and one of them is a poodle. Now, what's neat about poodles is that they don't shed very much, but they are very, very intelligent and very athletic. While golden retrievers are super playful, they are great family dogs, and they are super lovable. That's what makes Golden Doodle so popular, is this is a great mix. Now, the, that mix makes the Golden Doodle a great choice for a family pet or a lifelong pal, especially for folks who might have pet allergies. Though, no dog is completely hypoallergenic. I know people say that, but let's just say that dogs have some bodily fluids that might cause allergies. I'm talking about saliva. What are you thinking? <laughs> um, so again, they're a mixed breed, and that makes it hard to say exactly what their traits are. But we can guess that your golden doodle is going to be energetic and playful. It's probably going to love exercise. But at the same time, it's probably going to love kind of being lazy on the sofa and cuddling as well. We can guess that because there's been enough golden doodles, and they are super popular. Um, and we know that. Um... They are really good for families that are active. They would be great on hikes and going on walks because they have a lot of energy. So you got to make sure you get that energy out. These dogs can get pretty big. 
Um, they can range anywhere between 40 to like 80, even 100 pounds. They can get pretty big. And they love going on walks, runs, and lots of hiking as well. So if you're thinking about bringing a golden doodle into your family, make sure that you take them on outdoor, outdoor adventures because that's what a golden doodle loves the most, okay? All right, buddies, that's enough about these beautiful and cute little golden doodles. It is time for me to go and time for you to learn. Let's soar, Olinda, and make it a great day. Fly by, eagles.